What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome to more or less what is my first impressions of the new game that has come out. Yes, Ark Survival Ascended. It is the new version of Ark, and I have to say, it's kind of weird. I'm I'm still not used to it. I haven't been able to put that much time into actually playing. I've been kind of messing around mostly with my settings and a little bit with creative mode. And in today's video, I wanted to share a couple of my first impressions about it. And also, um, just for fun, kind of look at all the different armors and stuff that they have in it. Of course, everything is, you know, more or less the same as what was in the previous version of the game. However, you know, it's a little different. It's a little new. It, it it's weird. It's it's familiar yet so very new. Um in any case, yeah, I'm rocking right now the flak armor, which pretty sick. I have to say it looks good. The whole character creation, the character, I don't know, it just feels so much different. Everything, you know, kind of moves the same, but the animations, they're pretty sick. I like it. Look at the jumps. Like, it's silly. I, I don't really know what to make of it. I don't know if I like it yet or not, but this is what we got. So, yeah, very cool. Anyway, this is the flak armor. Let's go ahead and swap up. And as I kind of switch into the different armors, I can talk about some other things as well. But just to give you something to see, let's see, where's the full cloth? There we go. I think the cloth looks silly. It's funny, all the, uh, ooh, do we have the boots? Um, all the colorings of, you know, the basic colorings, like this is now like kind of whitish, you know, to start off with, which is weird. I'm not really used to. I, I still haven't been, a <laughs> been able to get the character quite how I like it. But, you know, it's something to start off with. So there's the cloth armor. And again, difference in coloration, but more or less the same. Dude, look at even the turds look different in this. Let's see if we can actually see it. Come here. Let's. Oh my goodness, why are you going poo so much? It's craziness. Um, let's see. It's really neat in the menu screens. You can like say just show me ammo. I kind of like this versus all items. Let's see if we can find this poo and throw it out so it doesn't fall through the ground. Is it always gonna fall through the ground? Dude, he chucked that. My goodness. Look at the the poo is way more detail. And then in here, we can press E, press F. Some things will have like extra menus within it. Anyway, I'm getting distracted now. Why are you going poo so much, bro? You're, you're crazy. Let's go ahead and switch to uh, the next set. Um, let's take a look at the ghillies, my favorite so far. Let's take a look at hide next. All right, so going through, what do we think of the hide? Look at that. It's like... It looks like Adobe, like, you know, like reds and orangey and browns. It's kind of cool. Kind of matches with my uh, hair color and whatnot. Dude, constantly going poo. I, <laughs> it's nuts. Um, as far as the graphics, there's a couple of commands, which I'll actually share in the description of the video that really dramatically help boost your FPS. Um, as you can see right here, looking out this way, I'm getting actually... Wow, that's the highest I've seen. It's like jumping between 70 and 90 over looking this way. It drops down to 50. It's, uh, you know, it's still early on and I am not running at the highest settings. I'll share what my settings actually are, but, um, you know, at some point in the video. But anyway, yeah, there's the hide. So kind of cool. Um, as far as like the foliage and everything, it's, I don't know. I still have not been able to get it right. There's like a weird like flickering that happens and i don't know which setting actually takes care of that the problem is you know a lot of settings probably if you had them on epic it wouldn't do that but you know if you run on epic um last night i tried to stream it when the game first dropped and holy crap it was lag fast um fps about and i have a pretty beastly computer um you can see my specs in the uh about section of my channel um, I was getting probably like 15 FPS, you know, running everything at Epic and then even dropping it down. But the probably biggest thing that really dramatically helped is a command that you can type in the console and it just removes all clouds. It was massive. That jumped me probably like 20, 30 FPS. So, yeah. Um, I'd say, though, everything does look cool. There's just so much different like clutter and everything, which looks amazing. 
but it definitely doesn't help. I turned off like the water reflection. That was another thing that was kind of unnecessary. But anyway, I digress. There's so many things I want to talk about with this. Like it's crazy. Just so many new things all at once. And of course, I didn't really pre-plan this video at all. So it's just first impressions and whatever goofiness. Ooh, look at all this stuff that you get. That seems different from a drop. I don't recall getting all those type of things. So that's kind of cool. Leech blood. Yeah. All right. All right. So where was I? Let's go on to the next armor. And let's have a look-see. So we are currently on hide. Let's, let's try and aim towards the sun. All right, there we go. Let's switch up to the next one. I guess next would be chitin. Ooh, that's kind of neat. Also, a lot of oranges and reds. Look at that. Yeah, and I mean, there is so much more detail towards, like, everything. Dude, what is with you? Why? What is going on? My food, my water, my fortitude... I don't even know. My guy just likes to poo, apparently. You know, that's just how Ark is. I didn't even mean to do the eyes, but they're green again. So, yeah, I think it looks super sick. Definitely. Again, things are a lot more like not as reflective and shiny. Again, I don't know if that's a setting I'm doing, but it's more of like a matte finish and probably more realistic. You know, almost like a crab shell or something. It's kind of neat. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Let's just bang through the armors and then I can switch topics. Because I know I started off promising you guys. All right, let's try. I guess flak would be next. I already started in flak, though. But we'll look at it again in a little bit more close detail. Is that Where's the chest piece? There we go. Yeah, so that goes more, you know, a blue metal. But again, it's not like shiny, shiny. You know, like flak in the, in the other version, it was like super shiny. Is it getting... I wonder if it's like raining... There's so many cool commands in this that you can do that you can just shut off fog, shut off clouds. I wouldn't doubt you can like turn off weather. Let's go ahead and let's change the time a day. Let's see, set time a day, 10, boom. So yeah, it's, it's interesting. Let's again try and aim towards the sun. All right, I wanna try something experimentation for this. Let's go to, I guess it would be here. Let's turn these on. I just want to see what it does. You know, bloom quality and light shafts might not be like ridiculous in this version. You know, it might just give that little bit of extra sheen or whatever or, or shine coming off things. So that's interesting. And I mean, in just in general, it seems like there's a lot less like reflections, which again, maybe I have a setting that I turned off reflections. But yeah, pretty cool. I like it. It looks neat. That jump, though. I wish they had more, uh, you know, like it would be a little bit more like change. So it's not like the same exact animation every time. It, it sort of looks fake, but it is neat. It's better than the other one where it was just like your body moved upwards. <laughs> it's funny. Um, but I mean, they have everything down to like, uh, I have it turned down really low, but you can even see like footsteps in the sand and whatnot, which again, I pretty much turned off. So, and then even look at the flaps on the armor as you're running and moving, kind of like flap up and down. Like it's neat. There's a lot of little minor details. Okay, let's move on to the next. Let's go to... Um, I should have done fur next, but let's go to Riot since it's already almost on. Look at that. Now that almost has... You almost see like a slight like tint of green, like, you know, army green on some of the outer plates. That looks really sick, actually. I have to say, you know what? I think this actually is my favorite. Look in the face, too. And look at the glass. It actually looks like real glass. Again, if you had your settings turned up high, it would probably look even better. That is really cool. Totally look like Stormtrooper. Oh, I like it. Oh, look at look at the pockets. Kind of like jingle jangle on you. That is so crazy. I, I definitely like it. This one, I think, is actually my favorite now. 
All right, let's try fur. I haven't seen the fur yet. Oh my lordy. Look at that. That I compared to the previous fur, this actually looks a lot better. You can tell like just the how realistic it looks with like the little individual weaves of hair. Oh, that looks really good. I like it a lot. Oh, man. I, I honestly can't wait to upgrade my graphics card so I can actually see this in its full glory. But even the textures, the leather, that that looks good. Very, very good. Okay. That one's quite awesome. Um, All right. Next, should we do scuba real quick? Dude, look at that yellow, though. And, of course, there's no scuba gloves. That looks a lot better than the normal one, too. Look at how much better it, it, like, fits the body. That is not bad. You can almost see the little... Like, it looks real, almost. Like, a real, like, kind of wetsuit. It's kind of leathery looking, even though I know wetsuits don't... I don't think have leather in them. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> look at the flippers. Oh, and look at the straps, how they, like, move on your body. That's pretty cool. Look at eating the hair. That's awesome. And the tank. It's the tank wobble. Yeah, I like it. All right, scuba. Um, what I say was the next one that we skipped? Oh, Gilly. I'm going to save Gilly. Let's see. I did Raya. I did for... No. Um, It's just Gilly and then tech. I've not even tried the tech yet. Now, the Gilly looks really good if you're in high settings. Um, the settings I changed to for better FPS, it's not quite as good, but isn't that nuts? Like that is a true ghillie suit. Like when you go out in the, uh, the full, what do they call it? Foliage. It's, uh, you blend in really well. They kept a lot of the aspects that made it like, look at that. That is truly incredible. Like, you truly blend in now. It is absolutely naughty. Let's see when you're laying down. Like, just look at that. You look, if, if you were to just, like, scroll through and see this right here, and you didn't, like, know, at a glance, you would not see this at all. It definitely makes it like the other one was more presentable for like a character to just have a armor that you rock all the time. But with this, you like it really seems like a true, absolutely true ghillie suit. So I have to say, I think this one's my favorite. However, in low settings with all the different like crazy like plant stuff, um, you know, it probably doesn't look at nearly as good. But at high settings, it is just absolutely epic. Added mushrooms and everything. Let's see without the hat. The hat's a bit much, but yeah, that that is quite nice. All right, finally, the last, the tax suit. What is this going to be like? I have not seen it yet. Hmm. This one is the first one that is like crazy shiny. Like, from the sun, from the bloom quality and everything. I don't have any element. Dang it. All right, there we go. So if you press tab, you can just search things by, um, you know, I just typed an element. I don't know what the rest of the code is, but then you see things that pop up that say, you know, right here, element. And I believe I can just do this and let's see, press enter. I don't know how to change the number on it, but, you know, it's giving me element. It's enough so that we can actually see the tech suit in action it's probably the same code as what it was in a s e now again the main reason i'm doing this in creative is to be able to you know be able to show you this stuff because otherwise it would probably take you know weeks if not months to get to but also i am waiting for uh, my server to get set up so you know just got to find stuff to kill the time don't want to go too crazy in single player um anyway yeah um for my particular character, I feel like it definitely doesn't look as cool as some of the other ones, but it's definitely, while looking the same, 
uh, you know, a little different. It seems like they put quite a lot of detail into it. Let's see, do we have anything that shakes? The shoulder pads do kind of move around. I don't know. It's interesting. Let's see. That looks pretty much the same. Ooh, I like that. The, uh... Oh, you know what, though? Okay, yeah. For a second, I was like, oh, is that the creative mode jump? All right, let's see. Flying. Looks pretty good. All right, and then... Crap, what is... I didn't do... All, there we go. That looks pretty similar. But... Awesome, awesome uh, effects. From the jetpack there. Yeah, it looks good. It looks really good. All right. Um, let's see about running. Whoa. Whoa. Now, the underwater of this map, too. Insanity. Absolute insanity what they've done. It looks so good, the underwater. I haven't explored it too much, but the few times that I've, you know, kind of got stuck underwater... Um, it's very impressive, and I feel like that's definitely something that was, you know, somewhat lacking in uh, normal arc, in the previous version of arc. So being able to have that now is very, very nice. Whoa! So we'll get into creatures in a future episode, but really the main things that I wanted to, you know, share with you. Also, weapons, dude. Look at the rock breaks. Like, it's incredible. There's a lot of neat things. And I think that as this mod, or excuse me, as this game gets further into de development, because obviously this is kind of like having like a beta version of the game. You know, it just launched literally less than a day ago. And I do think they were kind of, kind of rushed. Like it kind of got released a little bit sooner than they might have other well preferred. But it's... I think that a lot of the little bugs and stuff, they're going to be able to work out. And then also as they get, you know, further in, they can fix a lot of the graphics issues to where it's, you don't have to run an insane computer to actually, you know, run better graphics, but it definitely currently does require more than Ark Survival Evolved did. I ran Ark Survival Evolved at 100% max graphics, extended view distance, everything with zero problem and uh this game has given my my computer problems again still working out the settings and whatnot but anyway um so i guess in the next one we can probably check out some of the uh you know tools some of the uh other fun things that exist and of course i uh, get kind of a peek at all of the different creatures that there are so anyway, I think this one, you know, I, I kind of didn't know what I was doing. Didn't, you know, really have a plan. Just kind of hit record and I want to show you the armors. So I hope you enjoyed it and we'll look at other things in the next episode. Um, I said that I was going to share some of the commands that I use to help get away from things like right now I'm flying. Um, get away from some things like the clouds. Those I will link the codes. All you do is press tab and uh, pretty much copy paste them in right there and it will help dramatically for anyone and then a real quick uh, quick look at what my settings were for this video uh, as far as video going down some people were saying to do uh, full screen is better i actually found full screen window i don't know why it just works better for me um and then resolution want to have it 100 um right now running high I can't change this one. I don't even know what most of this stuff means, but view distance high, 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 medium. And of course, just put these down to low. If you're having problems, put everything down to low and just work your way up. But you want resolution at 100. You want to be at the settings your monitor is at. I don't do the max frame rate. I guess you could, but I don't think it's important. Turned off blur. Right now I had these on, but usually I play with them off. It's not as bad as what it was in the last version. And some of this stuff might be why the leaves don't look as well. But anyway, that's what I have there. RTX, this is what I have here. I have no idea. Um, UI, I haven't played too much with this. I probably should. Camera, what I currently have. 
um, and advanced what I currently have. So hope that was helpful. If there's anything else in here that I missed, let me know. But I will see you in the next episode. So thanks for watching. Make sure to slam that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the daily ARC awesomeness. And um, yeah, come check out. I have a lot of, you know, ARC Survival Evolved videos and shorts, pretty much what my whole channel is about. So yeah, come check me out, guys. Till next time. Thanks for watching. As always, peace out.